the land that has given India its thaliva and innumerable gems over years. Will it give India its first fit in your quiz champion? It is the state of Subramanya Bharati, Tirupur Kumaran, Velu Nachir and Subramanya Siva. It is the state of F1 star, Karun Chando, one of India's most successful squash players, Deepika Palikal, and Grandmaster Vishwanathan Anand is regarded as one of the greatest chess players. It is the land that cherishes its movies, stars, and knowledge. Saying so, we welcome you to the Fit India Quiz Tamil Nadu edition, presented by Ministry of Youth Affairs and Sports and Ministry of Education, with Fit India mission in celebration of Azadi Ka Amrit Mahotsav. Azadi Ka Amrit Mahotsav is an initiative of the Government of India to celebrate and commemorate 75 years of progress of India and the glorious history of its people, culture, and achievements. Fit India Quiz is the biggest Indian quiz on sports and fitness like none other. The Fit India Quiz provides an opportunity to students and schools to win cash prizes of Rs 3.25 crore and be the champion at state and national level. In the preliminary round, 36,299 students from 13,502 schools participated in the mobile based test conducted by the National Testing Agency. Participation was from more than 626 districts across India. After the preliminary rounds, 360 schools will be participating in the state web rounds where they will be competing with the selected schools from their respective state or union territory to become state or union territory champion and represent their state or union territory in the national finals. Without any further delay, let's go to our virtual auditorium to meet our quiz master for today. All right, students, we'll have a quick round of introduction. Team 1, can you please introduce yourself? Hi, ma'am. This is Hari Rajan, and I am studying in St. Thomas Medical Higher Secondary School. Hi, ma'am. I am A. Thomas Bruno Tilford from St. Thomas Medical Higher Secondary School. All right, Team 1, who is your favorite sports person? I like Saina Nehbal. And my favorite was a sports, sports person is Roy Sharma. All right, a very warm welcome to you, Team 1. Team 2, can you please introduce yourself? Hello, ma'am. I'm Danushri of Amrita Vidyalaya. I am B. Nitish Kumar. And teams, who is your favorite sports person? Rafael Nadal. Mine is Susan Gold. A very warm welcome to you too. Thank you. Moving on, Team 3, can you please introduce yourself? Greetings everybody, this is Navira Kumar. Greetings to everyone, this is Varun Anand. We are from the Academy. Teams, what is, who is your favorite sports person? For mine, that's Christian Ronaldo. My favorite person is Virat Kohli. Welcome team 3. Team 4, can you please introduce yourself? Hello ma'am, this is Amrit, representing Sagar International School. Hello ma'am, this is Akhil representing Saga International School. Boys, who is your favorite sports person? Ma'am, my sports personality is Mahindra Singh Dhoni. My famous sports personality is Robert Lavandis. Alright, a very warm welcome to you too. It's time to share who is our expert of the day. And our expert of the day is Mr. Amitabh Dotto. Captain Fit, a very warm welcome to you, sir. Thank you, ma'am. <clears throat> I am Captain Fit. Children, in case of any help, don't hesitate to ask my correct your answer. I'll try to help you in this regard. Thank you. Thank you so much, Captain Fit. Thank you, ma'am. Fitness ki doz aadha ghanta rose. Before we move on to the first round, I would like to tell all our participants that besides Captain Fit, you have two more helplines. One being heads or tails, which will make one... No, actually two incorrect options disappear. And toss the question which you can use to completely change your question. So are you guys ready? Ready for the first round? Just give me, give me a thumbs up on the screen. 
All right, good luck, boys. Moving on. First round, round number one, fitness kiddos. And here are the rules on your screen. Fitness kiddos. Questions on yoga, fitness and nutrition. Clockwise round. Direct question to each team. The question will not pass. Correct answer will fetch 10 points. And if lifeline is used, correct answer will fetch 5 points. No negative marking. Lifelines are available. Quizmaster's decision is final. Moving on to the first question for team 1 from Fitness Kiddos. On your screen. Which of the following is not true about Sheetali Pranayama, a form of breathing exercise? A. Relax the nerves and muscles. B. Control high blood pressures. C. Tightens and tones your arms. And or D. Treat disorders of dyspepsia. And your time starts now. Team 1, this is your question. Question. Yes, and we would team? like to lock up the C. Tightness and tones your arms. Tightens and tones your arms. Option C. All right, we'll take that answer, Team 1, because it is the correct answer. Congratulations, Team 1. You just earned yourself 10 points. Well done, boys. Moving on to the next question for Team 2. Dash Dandasana is a common yoga posture which strengthens the arms, shoulders, abdomen and back muscles. Fill in the blank. A. Astanga B. Panchanga C. Chaturanga and D. Sampurna And your time starts now. We are going with the lifeline. A little louder, team. Ma'am, we are going with the lifeline. Which lifeline would you like to use? Captain Fit. Captain Fit, all right. Captain Fit, you are requested here, sir. Okay, thank you. So, cap uh, team number two, you can opt for the C Chaturanga. That will be the correct answer as per my opinion. All right, team two, what is your final answer? Yes, we will go with option C, Chaturanga and Dasana. All right, we will take that answer because yes, it is absolutely correct. Captain Fit never goes wrong, isn't it? Thank you so much, Captain Fit. Thank you, ma'am. Five points to you, Team 2. Moving on to the third question for Team 3. Which piece of exercise equipment used in a weight training consists of a long bar with weights attached at the each end? A. Dumbbell B. Pulley C. Barbell or D. Kettleball And your time starts now. I would like to go with C. Barbell. C. Barbell? Alright, we will take that answer, Team 3. And it is absolutely correct. Congratulations, Team 3. You just earned yourself 10 points. <laughs> Moving on to the last and final question from this round for Team 4. Among the following, which fruit contains hundreds of edible seeds called arils that are rich in vitamins, fiber and minerals? A. Watermelon B. Grapes C. Pomegranate or D. Oranges and your time starts now. Come on team. Very easy question. Ma'am, you would like to have option, option C. Pomegranate. Option C. Pomegranate. We will take that answer because it is the correct answer. Congratulations team. You just earned yourself 10 points. Now it's time to take a short break and right after the break, we are going to take a look at this cause. Fit India quiz में देश के कोने कोने से भाग लेने वाले सभी विद्यार्थियों का मैं अभिनंदन करता हूं और आशा करता हूं कि आप सभी जी जान लगाएंगे, 
जीतने के लिए खेलेंगे फिट इंडिया क्विज में भाग लेंगे और अपने विद्यालय परिजनों एवं राज्य का नाम रोशन करेंगे आपको ढेरों शुभकामनाएं जय हिंद जय भारत to the break to the quarter final of the fit india quiz tamil nadu edition presented by ministry of youth affairs and sports ministry of education with fit india mission in celebration of azadi ka amrit mahotsav fit india quiz is the biggest indian quiz on sports and fitness now it's time to take a look at the scores Team two at five points. Team one, three, and four at ten points each. Well done, boys. All right, it's time to move on to our second round, and our second round is champion of champions. Let's take a look at the rules. Champions of champions. Questions on Indian sports personalities. Each clue on the buzzer. There will be three clues. to guess the answer each clue will fetch 15 10 and 5 points respectively the question will not pass wrong answer will fetch minus 5 points no additional lifelines for this round quiz master's decision is final all right teams get ready with your buzzer because this is going to be a buzzer round There'll be four questions. Each question will have three clues. The first clue is gonna be for fifteen points. The second clue for ten points, and the third is gonna be for five points. Are you guys ready? Yeah. Finger on your buzzer now. Moving on to the first question, and the first clue for fifteen points is here on your screen. She was originally given a name by her parents. Who derived the name from the word champion? Her father later changed the spelling to more closely resemble a Russian-sounding name. No one at the buzzer. Moving on to clue number two for ten points. In 2019, she won the FID Women's Rapid Chess Championship, and in 2020, she won the BBC Indian. Sportswoman of the Year award. No buzzes. All right, let's go ahead and check out clue number three for five points. No one can we please take a look at the answer now? It is Konaru Hampi. Moving on to question number two, and the first clue for fifteen points is here on your screen. He is the first Indian racer to win the British Formula Ford Winter Series in 1994, and first Asian to win the Asian Formula 2000 in 1996. I see blank faces here, boys. Moving on to clue number two for ten points. He became. He is actually. We are talking about this man. Became India's first Formula One racer in two thousand five, finishing eighteenth at the season. Yes, team three. Narin Kartikeyan. All right, all right. We'll take that answer, team three. Yes, because yes, it is Narin Kartikeyan. Congratulations! Congratulations, E3. You just earned yourself ten points. Moving on to the third question from Champion of Champions, and clue number one for fifteen points is here. At the age of nineteen, he became the youngest Indian boxer to qualify for the Olympics at the 2012 London Games. Come on, teams! All right, no buzzers. Can we go to clue number two for ten points? For his prowess, 
This Guwahati born boxer won the Arjuna Award in 2016. I know you're really trying to think hard. <laughs> it is showing on your face. All right, moving on to clue number three for five points. All right, we don't see any buzzers, so please, please take a look at the answer. It is Shiva Thapa. Moving on to the final question from Champion of Champions. This swimmer broke two national records at the Senior World Championships in July 2019. This is clue number one for 15 points. No buzzers. Can we go to clue number two for 10 points? He posted the best performance by an Indian swimmer ever in 50 meter backstroke event at the FINA Short Course World Championship in December 2021. No one at the buzzer. Moving on to the clue number three for five points. All right, we do not have a buzzer even now. Let's take a look at the final answer. It is Sri Hari Nataraj. Never mind, on that note, we are going to take a short break. And right after the break, we are going to take a look at this cause. Fit Rahna. उतना मुश्किल काम नहीं है जितना कुछ लोगों को लगता है फिटनेस की डोज आधा घंटा रोज इस मंत्र में सभी का स्वास्थ्य सभी का सुख छिपा हुआ है We are back after the break to the quarterfinal of the Fit India Quiz Tamil Nadu edition presented by Ministry of Youth Affairs and Sports, Ministry of Education with Fit India Mission in celebration of Azadi Ka Amrit Mahotsav. And our Honourable Prime Minister could not have said in a better way how important fitness is in our lives. Fitness ki dose, aadha ghanta rose. Now it's time to take a look at the scores. Team 2 at 5 points, Team 1 and Team 4 at 10 points each and Team 3 leading at this point with 20 points. Our next round is Bharat Ke Khel. And let's take a look at the rules. Bharat Ke Khel. Questions on traditional Indian sports. Anti-clockwise round. Direct questions to each team. No passing. Correct answer will fetch 10 points. And if lifeline is used, correct answer will fetch 5 points. No negative marking. Lifelines are available. Quizmaster's decision is final. This is going to be an anti-clockwise round. The first question is going to be for Team 4, the second question for Team 3, the third question for Team 2 and the fourth question is going to be for Team 1. This is the last round where you can actually use the lifelines. So if you wish to use a lifeline, here, this is the round where you can get to choose and use the lifeline you wish to. Moving on to our first question for Team 4 from Bharat Ke Khel on your screen. 
Seval Sandai or Seval Pur is a popular rural sport in Tamil Nadu. What sort of sport is it? A. Bullfighting B. Arm wrestling C. Cockfighting or D. Conch blowing And your time starts now. Mom, we would like to go with the option C. Cockfighting Option C. Cockfighting, we will take that answer team because yes, it is absolutely correct. Congratulations, you just got yourself 10 more points. <laughs> Moving on to the second question for team three. Take, let's take a look. Which popular indoor game has a red piece called the queen along with the nine darker and nine lighter pieces all having the same size? HS, B Chinese checker, C carom, D mahjong. And your time starts now. I would like to go with C carom. C carom will take that answer, team three. Because yes, it is absolutely correct. It is carom. Congratulations, team three. You just earned yourself 10 points. <laughs> Moving on to the third question for team two. Chaturangam, a traditional board game from Tamil Nadu, is an ancient variation of Dash. A. Snakes and Ladders, B. Ludo, C. Chess, or D. Checkers. And your time starts now. We will go with option C. Chess. Option? C. C. Option C. Chess. All right, we'll take that answer, team. Because yes, it is absolutely correct. Congratulations, you just earned yourself 10 points. <laughs> Moving on to the final question from this round for team one. Gulli Danda is a Hindi short story where the narrator of the story recounts his inability to play the game well. Who is the author of the story? A. Rabindranath Tagore B. Munshi Premchand C. Mahadevi Varma or D. Anand Chandra Barua And your time starts now. We would like to go with Captain Fifth Lifetime. Alright team, I would request Captain Fit to kindly please join us here sir. Thank you ma'am. I am very happy to join with the team. So, team one, you can opt for B, Munsi Prem Chang. That may be the correct answer according to my opinion. All right, this Captain Pitt, and what is your final answer, team one? Go with Captain Pitt. You will go with B. Captain? All right, it is Munshi Prem Chang according to you. And yes, it is absolutely correct because Captain Pitt never gets wrong. Thank you, sir. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, everybody. Now it's time to take a short break, and right after the break, we are going to take a look at the scoreboard. Fit India quiz में देश के कोने-कोने से भाग लेने वाले सभी विद्यार्थियों का मैं अभिनंदन करता हूं और आशा करता हूं कि आप सभी जी जान लगाएंगे, जीतने के लिए खेलेंगे, Fit India quiz में भाग लेंगे और अपने विद्यालय परिजनों एवं राज्य का नाम रोशन करेंगे आपको ढेरों शुभकामनाएं जय हिंद जय भारत वी आर बैक आफ्टर द ब्रेक टू द क्वार्टर फाइनल द फिट इंडिया क्विज Tamil Nadu edition presented by Ministry of Youth Affairs and Sports Ministry of Education with Fit India mission in celebration of Azadi ka Amrit Mahotsav Fit India quiz is the biggest Indian quiz on sports and fitness now let's take a look at the scores Team 1 and Team 2 at 15 points each, Team 4 at 20 points and Team 3 leading with 30 points. <laughs> Our next round is Freestyle. Let's take a look at the rules. Freestyle. Sports mixed bad questions. 12 questions on the buzzer. Correct answer will fetch each team 10 points. Minus 5 for wrong answer after buzzer 
No additional lifelines for this round. Quiz master's decision is final. Teams, as you have seen, this is going to be buzzer on. There will be 12 questions. You have to be ready with your finger on the buzzer. Because the moment you buzz, the first person who's going to buzz is going to get to answer. If you answer correctly, 10 points to you. If you don't answer correctly, minus 5 points. All right, teams. Um, good luck to all you boys. Moving on to the first question from Freestyle on your screen. Identify this legendary athlete who missed the Olympic podium by a whisker, Team 2. The answer is Neil Kassim. The answer is? Neil Kassim. Milka Singh, all right, we'll take that answer, team. Because yes, it is absolutely correct. Congratulations, you just earned yourself 10 points. Team, this is going to be question number two from Freestyle on your screen. This special edition Mahindra car with a customized number plate having the numbers 8758 was gifted to which golden boy in 2021? Team three. It's Neera Chopra. Neera Chopra will take that answer, Team three, because yes, it is absolutely correct. Congratulations, Team 3. You just earned yourself 10 points. <laughs> Moving on to our third question. Who among the following, a famous writer, was selected as one of the fit India icons? Chetan Bhagat or Arundhati Roy? Team 2. It's Chetan Bhagat. It is Chetan Bhagat according to you. Let's take a look at the answer. And yes, it is. Congratulations. It is Chetan Bhagat. And you just earned yourself 10 points. <laughs> Moving on to the fourth question on your screen. Sonil Gavaskar is the first cricketer to reach the milestones of 10,000 runs in Test cricket in 1987. True or false? Team 1. I'm true. True. All right. We'll take that answer, team, because yes, it is absolutely correct. You just earned yourself 10 points. <laughs> Moving on to our next question. Which Asian country will host the 2022 FIFA World Cup? Team 4. Qatar, man. Qatar, all right, we'll take that answer, Team 4, because yes, it is absolutely correct. It is Qatar. Congratulations, Team 4. You just earned yourself 10 more points. I am loving this round with you guys. All right, moving on to question number 6 on your screen. From this photograph taken in her childhood, to identify this Indian well-known sports person, Team 3. It's PV Sindhu. PV Sindhu will take the answer, team, because yes, it is absolutely correct. Congratulations. You just earned yourself 10 more points. <laughs> Moving on to our next question. Question number seven on your screen. The terms jab, uppercut, hook, and knockout are associated with which sport? Team two. It's boxing. Boxing? Yes. All right, we'll take that answer, team. And yes, it is correct. Congratulations. You just earned yourself 10 more points, team two. <laughs> Moving on to our next question. The winner of which annual tournament is awarded this trophy? Team four. Um, it's IPL. Indian Premier League. IPL Indian Premier League will take the answer because yes, it is correct. Congratulations, team. You just earned yourself 10 more points. Let me, before I move on, let me tell you all, there are only four more questions. And these four questions will actually determine whether you are going to the semi-finals of the state round or not. Are you guys ready? Yeah? Finger 
on the buzzer and here is a question the ninth question on your screen which famous indian said you will be nearer to heaven through football than through the study of the gita mahatma gandhi or swami vivekananda team one Ma'am, it's Mahatma Gandhi. Mahatma Gandhi will take that answer, but no, it is not the correct answer. It is actually Swami Vivekananda. Minus five points, team one. Moving on to the tenth question. Nicknamed the Highlanders, which club is currently coached by Khalid Jamil? Team three. It's North East United. North East what? North East United. North East United. All right, we'll take that answer, team. And yes, it is North East United Football Club. Congratulations, team. You just earned yourself ten points. <laughs> Moving on to the next question. Our next question is. Decathlon is a combined event in athletics consisting of how many track and field events? Team three. It's ten. Ten. Yeah. yeah. All right, we'll take that answer, team, and it is the correct answer. Congratulations, you just earned yourself ten more points. <laughs> and the final question from freestyle on your screen. Founded in 1927, this is the logo of Indian Dash Association. Fill in the blanks with a seven-letter word. Come on, teams! I must tell you, everyone is very close to each other. Your points are very, very close. So you have to. I must. I must say, you should. Team one. Team one, you need to answer if you're buzzed. What? What? Team one, if you don't answer, we are going to give you a minus five. Cricket. Cricket. All right, team one, we'll take that answer. But no, it is not cricket. It is Olympic. Minus five for team one. And on that note, we will take a short break, and right after the break, we are going to come back and take a look at the final scoreboard. Life में challenges कभी भी और कहीं भी आ सकते हैं, और हम इनका अच्छे से तभी सामना कर सकते हैं जब हम तैयार हों इनको face करने के लिए। हम अगर healthy और fit हैं, तो हमारी तैयारी और भी बेहतर हो जाती है। बस जरूरत है थोड़ी सी मेहनत, थोड़े से अनुशासन की। Presenting Fit India Mobile App, आपका फिटनेस गाइड और पर्सनल हेल्थ ट्रेनर। पहली बार अब भारत का हर एक नागरिक अपना फिटनेस गोर पता करके जान पाएगा कि वो कितना फिट है। आप अपनी आयु के अनुसार अपने फिटनेस गोर की जांच कर सकते हैं। ये सुविधा खास आपके लिए पहली बार शुरू की जा रही है। ये ऐप आपके फिटनेस रूटीन को ट्रैक ताकि आप अपनी प्रोग्रेस देख सकें और फिट रहने के नए और आसान नुस्खे अपना पाएं। इस ऐप के साथ आप बन सकते हैं खुद के फिटनेस मास्टर। उसके बाद हम आपके फिटनेस रूटीन को बनाने में आपकी मदद करेंगे। फिटनेस की दुनिया में कदम रखें, मोटिवेटेड रहें और अपडेटेड रहें। और सबसे अच्छी बात है कि इन सारी सुविधाओं का लाभ आप पा सकते हैं एकदम फ्री। बस अपने एंड्रॉइड और एप्पल डिवाइस पर हमारे ऐप का हिंदी और इंग्लिश वर्जन डाउनलोड करें और शुरू हो जाइए। आपका फिट रहने का सपना अब है एक क्लिक दूर। फिटनेस की डोज आधा घंटा रोज। We are back after the break to the quarterfinals of the Fit India Quiz Tamil Nadu edition presented by Ministry of Youth Affairs and Sports. Ministry of Education with Fit India mission in celebration of Azadi Ka Amrit Mahotsav. Before we move on to see this course, let me just remind you that you too can download the Fit India app 
from the Play Store or App Store and be fit every minute, every day. And now we move on to that part of the episode which the audience is eagerly waiting for. The Fit India Daily Quiz question. The process to participate in this quiz is very simple. I will ask one question related to sports and fitness here. All you have to do is to log into the Fit India mobile app and answer the question in the Fit India Daily Quiz section. The user who gives the correct answer in the fastest time will win a Fit India merchandise. Also, some of the lucky winners will stand a chance to be in the grand finale of the Fit India quiz. Just download or update the Fit India mobile app, which is India's most comprehensive fitness app, offering features like generating your fitness score, customized diet plan, steps tracker, calorie tracker, sleep tracker, and much more. And the biggest advantage is that you can use all of these features for absolutely free. This is only being offered by the Fit India mobile app, right? So here is the question for this episode. Regarded as one of the greatest athletes of all time, how many Olympic gold medals were won by Usain Bolt? A7, B8, C9, D10. And now it's time to take a look at the final scoreboard. Team 1 at 15 points, Team 4 at 40 points, Team 2 at 45 points and Team 3 the winner, 70 points. Congratulations boys. Congratulations to Team 3 and Team 2 for qualifying for the state semi-finals. With, with this we are at the close of the quarter-final of the Fit India Quest Tamil Nadu edition. A big thank you to the Ministry of Youth Affairs and Sports and the Ministry of Education for giving all of us and especially the children of India the opportunity to be on a platform like this. This is me Dia Da signing off and don't forget the magical mantra, fitness ki dose, aadha ghanta dose.